Kelly Barlow Creations. If you are new to my channel and stopping by for the first time, thanks for stopping by. Welcome to my channel. Stick around a while by clicking that red button for more crafting on a budget, more everything on a budget videos to come. And if you click it when the bell appears, YouTube will notify you when I'm uploading a new video. If you're interested in following me on social media, you can find those links in the description box below, along with my PO box if you're interested in sending me mail and watching me open it up in a video. So what's going on for today? Today I am bringing to you a new series of videos that I came up with a couple of weeks ago that I'm really excited about. It is a series that I'm gonna call Bleak to Chic or Blah to Fab. I'm not sure, and what it's gonna consist of is items that you would typically see that are just blase, blah, that are really bleak, that you would typically pass up in the store because they're blah and they're bleak. I'm gonna take them and show you just what you can do with these items, so maybe next time when you see something that's bleak or blah, you're not gonna pass it up because you're gonna see the possibilities of what it could be with just a little DIY. I will be transforming Dollar Tree's LED lights into something so stinking cool, you are going to love this. So let's jump into this and let me show you just how quick and easy this transformation is of Dollar Tree's LED candles. You are going to love this. For this transformation, I picked up three of Dollar Tree's LED pillar candles. I'll also be using some of Waverly's chalk paint in the color of ivory and Waverly's wax paint in the color of antique. You can find Waverly chalk paint at Walmart in the crafting section. For the chalk paint trial size bottles, which are three ounces, you can get them for $1.25 a bottle. For the antique wax, it is $1.67 for the trial size, but let me just tell you, this antique wax paint by Waverly is amazing and it is worth the $1.67 because it goes so stinking far. I'm gonna start this transformation off by taking the chalk paint in the color of ivory by Waverly and I'm gonna do a real nice thick base coat over the LED candle. I'm using chalk paint instead of an acrylic matte paint because I have found in the past that the acrylic matte paint doesn't adhere to the wax coating that's on the outside of these candles very well at all. It comes off easily, it scratches easily, the chalk paint upholds perfectly and it adheres just right. I'm gonna do this to all three of my pillar candles. Once my paint is dried, I'm gonna take a straight edge razor and I'm not gonna put the blade all the way out and I'm gonna very gently put lines in the candle, lines like you would see in the bark of a tree. You don't have to press hard with this. This isn't dangerous, but you do need to be a bit careful. And I'm just gonna hold it like a pen and make lines all the way around this candle, again, to give the illusion that these are lines in the tree bark. And this here is what you should be left with. Now using the Waverly Antique Wax Paint, I'm gonna take and just brush this on over the chalk paint and the lines that I just put into this candle. I'm not gonna worry about making the paint even. I want this paint to be uneven. I want it to be thicker in some spots, lighter in others, so that way it gives the illusion again of that uneven tree bark where there's darker and lighter parts. And that there is all there is to this transformation of these LED candles that you can get at the Dollar Tree. I love the tree bark wood look that these give off. And when they are lit, they look so stinking amazing. Let's light these up and see how they look. And there you have it. These turned out so stinking amazing. I love them. Don't forget, if I've inspired you to make one of my projects, snap a quick picture, send it to me on Facebook because I love seeing all of your creations and I can feature them in an upcoming video. And there you have it. Tell me these candles are not so stinking cute. I love these candles. These are definitely a set of candles that I put in my motorhome for when we're camping. And I'm honestly thinking about doing another set for here in the house. I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please give this video a thumbs up and let's get this video to 2,000 likes. 
Until next time, everybody, I hope you have a fantastic day. Happy crafting on a budget, and bye for now, everybody. Thank you.